everybody, it's me. Well, who else could it be? Um, this is going to be my second haul in two days. So I've been to town the day with my daughter and my, and my youngest grandson, who's only three. Um, and we had it's like a thing we do every Christmas that we we'll go out in December for one day in the town or the metro centre. We'll have something to eat because she works a lot, so she doesn't get the time to actually do this kind of thing. But it's the one one day I take her into the town, buy a new bag for Christmas, things like that. And we've had a good day. I've, I've only been in about 20 minutes and I've just made myself a cup of So. And some bee mug. So, been to town, spent money. Um, went and had fish and chips at George's in Ellen Square. Really, really nice. I had cotton chips and it was absolutely fantastic. But I was like, just like, just the perfect butter. Anyway, so been there, um, and that's about it. So I'm going to get on with the haul. It's a mixed haul because there's stuff in loads of different bags. You know what I mean? It's just we're just paying stuff in bags, and uh, well, you get what I mean. Um, I think this might be all. Um, Oh, this may be all Primark. Oh no, this was people's uh, price thing. Got for my partner. Got him some uh, walking socks. Just got him these because um, he always needs socks and always buying socks and underpants for Christmas. You know what I mean? General men's stuff. So they were three pound for three pair, and they're quite thick. So they'll do him. I um, actually got this, and it's a Tokyo Laundry, which is a decent make. I got it for a fiver. Yeah. Got it for my partner. He doesn't watch it, so you won't know. He's only like, he's quite slight framed compared to me. I mean, that's a kind of look. I like it, um, sort of very, like, I don't know, like, a slimish kind of person. Even though I'm quite the biggest person, it's a bit odd, but you know what I mean. That's my preferred type. I like any type, but that's my preferred type is like the the sort of like skinnyish, sort of odd looking people. I like that type. So he's skinny, he's like odd looking, but he's skinny because he's got a digestive problem. Poor so <laughs> works works wonders for me. <laughs> So I've gotten that, and it's a Tokyo Laundry, so I bought Kanko for the price anyway, like it's five that, so um, I've gotten, I've gotten much of, I've gotten an Udi and um, other stuff and Jarmaz, just bits and bobs. I've got this for the card factory for the little one, but he wasn't interested because he was having a crying fit. God, my eyes. I think that was two pound fifty. I'll take it up the mouth for him, and you, you'll be all right because he's been he's in a better mood. Um, I think this is all the primer. That's me some of my bags, which I didn't use. I end up buying bags because I put them right in there. Got them these jeans, um, straight leg denim ones, and these were eighteen pound. So. I think Primark is getting more expensive. Comment if you believe if you think the same. It used to be a really cheap shop. It's not anymore. You know what I mean? Because people thingy. You know what I mean? What well, I don't even know what I'm talking about now. I'm just fucking rambling. A new brownie cost me to knock out, and this was four pounds. It was either a black or white one. Oh yeah, so I've got this blue one. Well, it'll probably break after a couple of uses. It is something not the camera. It is Primark stuff, you know what I mean? Um underpants for my partner. Um these were six pounds for three pay. And they're just loose fit boxes. That's what he likes. So 
Um, bought that from my grand, one of the grandson's little bags. It's for his pack lunch. It's Marvel knife and fork, a little plastic cup, we said. But it's a hard plastic, so I thought that would be kind of just to stick in as a little something or that, you know what I mean? Um, got them for my son-in-law. Just to, I've got some new job, Marvel jams. I just thought I'd get him some of these slippers, and they were six pound. Um, got that for the oldest grant, and he's sixteen, but he loves Star Wars. So, got me Yoda hot water, baby Yoda hot water bottle. They're only the small ones, but he's always complaining he's got cold feet. So. And I've got the other grandson, a Groot one. Well, baby Groot. I am Groot. I know it sounds not like it, but you know what I mean. Um, is that the receipt? I'll tell you how much it came to. Um, I bought couple of pairs of gloves for my grandsons to hide in the bag. They're only a pound each. I'm not wrapping them, they're just like something you hide in. They always need gloves anyway. Um, what else is it? But this nail varnish, this was two pound and I like the the colour. I'm trying to do that thing. It's blue, it's blue but it looks purple. Try to do that like, you know, like that. Mm -hmm. I'm, so there, so I've got that, that's for me, because all my new varnishes are still packed away. Plus with me, like, my bracelets and that, so I need to find them. Uh, got some false nails. I want, I want to try, somebody says these are all right, and these are £1.80, and I, I like these ones, just as a try. I'm good, so I'm going to try these out. See if any good, and then I can make it some more pairs. That's some nice Christmas ones and my candy canes and that on. So I might get some of them for Christmas date. And I've been looking for a Christmas date top. And I went to New Look and they had some lovely ones, but none in my size. They say they go up to size 22 in the shop. Where? I've never found a 22 in that shop. I mean, I'm not a 22 but I'm hovering between an 18 to 20. I used to be like 16. But obviously, I've put weight on. And the last thing is, I bought myself how much are these again? Three pound. Some Christmas Christmas socks, five pair for three pound, and all right. They're nice, and they don't have to be actually for Christmas. Some of them are, but some of them, like that, can be any time. So they were three pound, and that was all I bought from Primark, and that lot come to sixty five pound fifty p. So it come to not a, a cheap amount. That's what I mean. You're not getting as much for your money now in Primark. So what can you do? You've got to, people have got to have Christmas presents and things like that. Well, they have for me, I feel stupid just giving them money or oh, gift cards. I like to buy presents. I like to have, have, have something to wrap up and have them open. I've got to do that as well. I've got to do all my wrapping this, starting this weekend. So I'm going to be trying to get all my presents in the next few weeks, couple of weeks, all the ones I need. So I'm putting them all in there. Sorry, I'm like, I'm not, I'm not ignoring you on purpose. Oh, that good. And that's that, all in that bag. Right, um, what's it that for? And then I popped into TK Maxx. I've been to the shops as well and didn't buy anything. Went to loads of shops. Um, bought this for my partner because it was only six pounds. It's just like a little. He likes globes, and I thought this is a nice little one. He's got big ones. He's got a big one, them gemstone globes, 
it's not huge but the next sign still he's got one of them which he got years ago and that sort of kick start off so now he likes globes i can't remember if he's got that but we have another one to match won't he so it's tough titty if, he, if he's gone he's got another done of it and i bought a certain like t-shirt for me littlest grandson to go with his tracksuits and that for christmas and that was only nine pound so that's good for even for a night t-shirt for his size is normally like nearly 20 odd quid so i popped into the christmas market which i'm trying i'm seeing not to visit you know what i mean i'm not telling you not to visit but there's not that much to buy it's mainly all food stalls there's a few nice bits you can buy like i walked there and i took a photograph of it i don't know how to insert it because i would have done but there was a box of cocks you know like wooden ones but like bottle openers and that just had me creased it's not very christmasy you know what i mean well i suppose you could have put tinsel around it but come on <laughs> I was laughing, it's like a box of cocks. You know what I mean? But I did buy this for myself for the house to go on the thing. I love this kind of stuff. I'm a bit of a hippie at all. So I bought one of these little like things that's got uh, moons and stars on, which I quite like. I could have probably made it myself for the amount I paid for it. It was, a, it was six pound, it wasn't a lot. See, I've got a Chinese look one as well like this, but that's red and gold. That's no new, but it's been put away till after the Christmas. So I got that for myself. This is, I think this is going to be quite a quick video, you know. And I popped into Mankind and spent £15 on me for my son law, a Deadpool pop figures, because he likes Deadpool. You know what I mean? And this is the Christmas one with the Christmas jumper on. I'm going to get him some Nordic socks because he's sick of his feet being cold and he's a truck driver. Like he, he, dri he works for a company and he drives a truck delivering stuff and his feet are always cold. So he says he wants some really good socks because he says it's the one thing he can't stand is having cold feet and I know exactly how he feels. Because I wake up every morning, my feet are cold and numb and but that's because I've got neuropathy. So... And then I went to River Island for my daughter. See, when I take the town, I always get her a bag for Christmas. She never uses it till Christmas. She says, take it home and wrap it up. So I bought her this bag from River Island. She's in these little bags now. One pound, she would have carried a big bag. But now she just likes these ones. And I'm the same, I don't carry big bags anymore. And I also bought a bottle of River Island perfume. And she really likes this. It's, it's actually quite nice. And it, it keeps it like fragrance for ages. So that's part of the Christmas present. Plus she's got like a Pandora necklace. A couple of other bits and bobs. I don't know. I still suppose I just I still see her as my little girl, you know what I mean? And I've only got the one, I haven't got any more children. I've just got her and the grandkids. So it'd be different if I wasn't like my sister. She's got four kids and just got ten grandkids, you know what I mean? And then uh, we went to Poundland was the last one we went to. So this is like I see, it's not going to be a quick haul. Um, I, oh, she popped into Tesco to get us some strawberries. Because I had fish and chips a day and I don't really fancy anything heavy tonight. So I'm just going to have some fruit and yoghurt for me tonight because that's all I fancy. So that's all I have for tea tonight. So I popped it in and... Um, is that the receipt? I bought this little ceramic oven dish with the lid at £2.50. I had a couple and it got broken in the move, so I bought, bought myself one. 
it's for when I do my baked oats like, and stuff like that and that's a perfect size to have for my breakfast or if I want a late if I want like a sort of cake, a healthiest version of a cake, I'll do that on a night time. But blitz your your oats and that makes all the difference. It's much more cake like if you blitz your oats. So use that, got that. Um just doing a chocolate hamper at work for and the proceeds are going to Maggie's which is where my support group is and it's it's a good charity you know me because it's not just for the patient it's for the full family as well the, in the offer like Greek counts and loads of things benefits advice um wellness things like that they offer loads of things and there are really nice relaxing spaces they've got lovely garden and it's got a big kitchen table that you can sit around and it's it's sort of meant to feel a bit like a home away from home if you get what I mean. Anyway, so I've got these snowy fingers and I think we will have to check. Sorry. Uh, one fifty to go into the hamp. I think it's all like chocolate and biscuits. Um, we've got I've got this fudge. It says luxury fudge collection. Ooh, that sounds nice actually. Ooh. Or that one. Hey. Or but a fudge Belgium chocolate brownie, sea salt caramel and clotted cream. Oh, that sounds really nice. And that was, you'll have to bear with, because I haven't got any glasses beside us, and I kind of see a bat. I need to get me, I need to get my eyes tested. Fudge, two pound flat box, which is not bad. You know what I mean? So no, um, I bought one of them little selection boxes, just like one of them ones, and that was, Cadbury's selection box. Uh, two pound. Uh, why do they, they can't call themselves pound land anymore, really, if you think about it? Pound 25p land? Yes, not, not pound land. Um, I bought these family friend, family circle biscuits. Everybody remembers these. Most people still get them, and it's just got like jammy, like a mixture of like all old favourites, like tea biscuits, I would say. And um, biscuits, biscuits, biscuits. Oh, yeah. Two pound fifty, so that's not too bad. Um, I got some. Festive friends, these were one twenty five. So was it one twenty five? Yes, one twenty five. I got some these Kit Kats, like snow things. These were one twenty five. Um, these dairy dairy little robins. These were one twenty five. You're getting the gist, aren't you? One twenty-five. Um, some Cadbury's chocolate coins, which I'm going to get some of them for the kids, because we all love Cadbury's chocolate when I do it. Seeing that chocolate coin should be cheap chocolate, I think. You know what I mean? Anyway, um. I bought a couple of bottle of bags because I've got a bottle of wine for me brother-in-law and I've got him some liqueurs because he loves these liqueurs at Christmas. Some famous names. He loves famous names. They're his favourite. So they were a pound for two. Um, I've got this. It's a honeycomb tree decoration. I'm going to hang it off in my kitchen window because I've only got a small window. So what I'm going to do is hang that in it and put some lights around it, like round the window, because it the thing is on onto the front. It's like it's a weird way my house works anyway. 
So I thought that would be nice just to festiv it up a bit. I'm sorry, my mouth's really dry. Mm. I've got a pack of double A batteries because God knows why I'll need them. Uh, batteries, batteries, how much of these want? Uh, these were two pound for them ones we get um eighteen and then I got a pack of eight triple E, you know like for remote controls and stuff because I always need these little ones and these were pounds so I had to stock up with batteries. I got two bottles of me mouthwash these were pound each and a bottle of gold um nail varnish now this nail varnish is excellent try getting the fuck out off though christ it just doesn't want to come off it like honestly you can it can, it can it'll easily stay on your fingernails for two weeks or more if you look after it so good i've got a few of them ones but like i see they're all packed away at the minute so and the last thing i bought was i should have had them before is some new readers because oh god look at that because like i see i've lost my other pair and i do diamond paint and i wear these so i can like see the symbols because i'm going blind as a bat i really should go and get my eyes tested but i just haven't got time i've got to go to the dentist oh i need to go to the dentist because i've got to have a range to have these four teeth out well five now because i've got to get the one that's in my gum is sort of starting to descend but it's descending on an angle so i've got to get that out as well so five teeth out that means I'm going to have no teeth at the top left. Thanks fucking cancer. It's just the gift that keeps on fucking giving, isn't it? Do I sound bitter? No. <laughs> and they were... I think they were only... Um, they weren't much. I see the readers. In the handy to have in, you know, like in the drawer in the kitchen or something. Um, Reading glasses, glasses... How are you, man? Glasses. How are you? Sorry about this. Oh, I bought a a bag to put them in for a pound as well, by the way. I can't find them. Got to be on here, haven't I? I think they were about two pound anyway. But so they weren't expensive. I'm seeing it's going to be quick, but practically the same like the same time as what I normally do and I'm going to ask them tomorrow so there'll be one tomorrow as well you're going to be inundated with holes or I don't know if I should just leave this no, I think I'll upload it and then it's out the way and it's done Um, yeah so that's been my idea beat the town, saw a box of cocks had fish and chips spent a bloody fortune and my feet are aching Merry fucking Christmas <laughs> No, I had a nice day. My feet are aching, mind. <laughs> and I did spend a small fortune. So I'm dreading looking in my bank. Anyway, I'm going to go off now because I'm going to sit and put my feet up and just relax for an hour. So you know what I'm going to say? Be good, be kind, but most of all, be excellent to each other. And you know what? Just be a nice human. Bye.